An enumeration is a special kind of value type consisting of a list of named constants. To create one, we use the enum keyword followed by a name and then a block containing a list of constant elements. This enumeration type can now be used as a holder for these constants. To assign it a value, we access the elements as if they were static members of a class. The switch statement provides a good example of when we have use for enumerations. Compared to using ordinary constants, the enumeration has the advantage of allowing us to clearly specify what constant values are allowed, and IntelliSense also makes them much easier to remember. Usually, we don't need to know the actual constant values that the elements represents, but sometimes it can be useful. By default, the first element has the value 0, and each successive element has one value higher. We can override these default values by assigning the elements to any values we want, included computed values. These values don't even have to be unique. The underlying type of the elements are implicitly declared as int, but we can change that using a colon after the enumeration's name, followed by the integer type we want. The access levels for enumerations are the same as for classes. They are internal by default, but can also be declared as public. Although enumerations are usually defined directly in the namespace, they can also be placed within a class. They then have private access by default, and can be set to either one of the access levels. We can cast an enumeration constant to an integer, and we can use the toString method to get its name. For any other enumeration method we may need, we can usually find them in the system enum class.